I think my boyfriend is no longer into me. I, 20 female, didn't hear from my boyfriend, 22M, for four days. The fifth day he had two excuses, the first one was he was busy which is true. But I always heard people still contact their partner when they are busy for at least a little bit. So I told him he could have at least talked to me a little. His excuse for that was he lost his second pair of $200 headphones, he lost his first pair, now these, while he was at work and didn't want to call me because he didn't want to put his phone to his ear. He also didn't want to text me either because he says I'm a boring texter and my conversations are boring usually. He says I am improving though. We texted when I went to work that fifth day the whole day with no problem. What do you think? And hash x200b. Too long did not read. Boyfriend was busy for four days and lost his headphones so he couldn't talk on phone. Didn't want to text me either cause him a boring texter he says. And hash x200b. Edit. We've been together for six months. Those are terrible excuses. Even if he thinks you are a boring texter, in those four days he still could have texted just to reach out, check in, let you know he's not avoiding you, etc. And okay, he may have been busy, but it takes literal seconds to send a text. If you've only been together six months, and this is how he's going to be, I'm not sure it's worth it to stay with him. Honestly, why would you stay with someone who clearly makes you feel insecure? If you actually cared about someone you're in a relationship with you would reach out every single day. Unless you literally can't. He doesn't care about you. This guy is an awful liar. He very likely cheating on you. Probably spent that four days with another woman and didn't message you because he didn't want to get caught by her texting or calling you. He sounds super shady. If I'm into someone I'll make time to talk to them. Nobody, nobody is that busy. You make time for the ones you love or at least heading in that direction. I would never tell a woman, that she is boring. Question. Has he always been like this? If yes, I'd question why you're still with him. If this is something new, then he might be interested in someone else. But telling your significant other that you find him a boring texter is messed up. I'm in an LDR with my boyfriend, last December my area was hit by a storm. I was still able to tell my boyfriend we're okay, hours after cell service was gone on all networks. I tried to message him daily, but messages won't go through. When the service came back up, the messages flooded in. Girl, I tell you. He messaged me daily, each day increasingly worried. That's how it is. Your guy has some pretty lame excuses, and you have to decide if it's worth it. If he let those silly things stop him from messaging you, what else would stop him? Would he just ghost you one day? He has another girlfriend 100%. I think your boyfriend is a douchecano. As a law student, I work 73-78 hours a week. I'm admittedly a shitty girlfriend at times, but I've never felt too busy to send my boyfriend a text at least once a day or every two letting him know I'm alive. Unless the man was on an FBI mission, IDK why sending a text was so hard. What the hell does he think you should do? Do linguistical gymnastics every time you type. Sounds like he's seeing someone else. Red flag, big time red time. The longest I've ever gone without texting my girlfriend was two days and that was because I had final papers, exams, and project to finish my senior year of HS. We have beeped together four years and other than that one time I haven't gone a full day without at least texting her good morning and good night. He also didn't want to text me either because he says I'm a boring texter and my conversations are boring. This kinda says all you need to know, doesn't it? I think if a guy really likes you, he wouldn't stop texting you because, you're a boring texter, when was the last time you were bored while texting someone you like a lot? Personally, if I were you, I'd take this as a sign that you're incompatible. I'd stop texting him if I were you. To be fair, I've dated a couple of super cute chicks some years ago for at least six months that were very boring texters, I'm talking one word replies for just about everything. Huge turn off, kicked M to the curb. But on another note, now in a relationship of two plus years with her, two kids, both boys 7 and 14. Our 14 Y, O absolutely refuses to do anything without his Bluetooth headphones, he is super attached to them, which is also extremely weird to me. Anyway, I am H O, move on, you're young and it's obvious the dude cares more about his headphones than he does you. Not cool, you can do better. Those are genuinely terrible excuses. I wouldn't say he's not into you but I do believe those are some red flags. He could have at the least stated, hey sorry I've been busy, or some kind of reassurance. 
you deserve respect, so I would bring that up if it happens again and if he doesn't at least give you the reassurance for situations like this then it's probably not worth being in the relationship if that's how you'll be treated. He is making you feel small and wrong. Is that a good feeling? If not, leave his uninterested ass and go find yourself. I'm sorry for being old but to me you are basically a baby. Please get your shit together try enrolling in a martial arts class. Just, you know, something to make you feel strong instead of vulnerable to dumb guys. He is not the one for you, I promise. Sorry to tell you this, but if you guys aren't seeing each other daily, then you aren't boyfriend, girlfriend, and he is still shopping around. Those are definitely excuses for him being around other girls. My boyfriend got rid of the relationship status on here I really love him I have a broken heart now. They always do that when they start to become uninterested. Just do what you gotta do and leave while you can before you find something out and get hurt, trust me. No, it would appear that you two are not right for each other. Being bored by someone's texts means the chemistry is just not there. When you meet the right person, you both know. The chemistry is right, the passion is there but not straight up infatuation or lust. You will find yourself going out of your way for the other person and doing things you've never done for anyone before and you genuinely don't mind and don't even note any sort of resentment or feel like you're being put out in any way. It hits different when it's right. It's like the difference between a McDonald's burger and a Michelin star steak. Y'all are not a Michelin star steak, throw that burger to the seagulls and move on to the next. You've only been around for a short time. Take your losses and go. It seems your boyfriend is not making efforts on his end. Those are shit excuses. You guys are either reaching the difficult phase after the puppy love phase or the guy has just lost interest. It's not hard to talk. And blaming you for being boring, sounds like he doesn't take an interest in the conversation anyway. Either way, this dude has made it clear the kind of effort he's currently willing to put in. Which is minimal, conditional and grudgingly. Expressionless why is this even a question? Leave. He's banging someone else and it didn't work out so now he's back. He insulted you so you would break up with him. It sounds like he has another GF. Shit excuses, even if he was busy he should have told you before he ghosted you. Even a good night text, sorry I was busy today. YK. Sorry but move on. Next. No one who is into you will call you boring. He's checked out. What I've found to be true is people who want to make time. My boyfriend and I both travel and contact is critical when either of us are out of town. Even when we're on the road we find time to send texts, videos, FaceTime, cute pics of where we're at or what we're doing. There has been small handful of times he was in all day meeting and still managed to send me quick texts on their breaks or when he went to the bathroom. Some people don't feel the need to communicate at that level and that's okay but if your boyfriend isn't making the time you need to feel appreciated there's people out there who will and finding a partner with comparable communication styles will make you feel so much more secure in your relationship. If your boyfriend calls you a boring texter, he's not the one. I do care for a person you find or make the time to reach out. If they don't care then they won't. I talk to friends and family every day no matter what. No mom. You deserve somebody that makes you a priority and that is now what is happening right now. The absolute bare minimum is him contacting you once a day. You are 20 and you are too young to be getting ignored by your boyfriend for that long. Attaching to someone like that is always a waste of time, find someone else. He doesn't like you and isn't even smart enough to even come up with good excuses. He didn't want to put his phone to his ear. I laughed out loud that's so ridiculous. Here's the thing I would say right now to reframe this. Instead of wondering whether he is into you, ask yourself are you attracted to this? He's being inconsistent and rude. I'd be turned off by that and behave accordingly. Just dump him, H-E-S stupid. If he really likes you, he would have contacted you. W-T-H. And you still wondering what to do. Leave that rude ass bastard. You teach people how to treat you. Know your worth and don't put up with anyone who makes you feel this way. Six months and he's behaving like this. Girl run. Musical notes you're still young, that's your fault, there's so much you have to know. Musical notes. You're losing his attention. You must compete for it. You must up your game. Think of some naughty texts you might send him while he's at work that are by no means boring. Think of some titillating subjects to discuss with him while on the phone. Make it so exciting that he skips video games just to talk to you. Give him a role to play. Make him feel important. Ask him to guide your hand. Let him know how he makes you feel. 
Terrible excuses plus he sounds super lame. You should find someone who is actually into you and is interested. Find someone that's worth your time and that enjoys the same things you do. GL smile. Well if he's into you he would even find your everyday good morning wishes to be interesting. If he finds talking to you boring he clearly isn't into you. A key part in every relationship is respect. He doesn't have any respect for you. If you constantly have to ask for the attention you seek then just stop hurting yourself and get rid of it as soon as possible. Don't stretch it further. I'm going to jump to conclusions and say he was with someone else. That's the only reason I've heard of people doing this shit. Wow. That fact that you have to ask what to do is crazy. You want someone that wants to be there, he is not putting the effort, move on. That happened with only a few days, imagine a month. Man facepalming light skin tone. Dude he's not worth it. Leave him and spare you of the worries and stuff. There's better guys out there. If someone's really interested in you, they'll be texting you every day, no matter what. Dump him. Don't put up with that BS. You deserve the minimal effort. At the very least. If I was your mom I'd kick his ass for not seeing you for the queen you are. I think he's a crappy ass boyfriend. Find yourself a person that makes you feel cared for always. Someone that never makes you question yourself or your relationship. I've been dating my boyfriend for four years now and we live together but we still chat or call every day when we're not physically TGT. Sorry but your boyfriend sounds so rude and you deserve better than his stupid ass.